Hey guys, and welcome back to another week of dinners. This week, I only have three meals that I have filmed because it's been kind of a hectic, crazy week. So tonight, I'm starting off with zucchini boats. As you can see, I chopped up some onion. I'm just browning some ground beef with some garlic. I'm really excited and found this recipe on Pinterest. So I'm scooping out the inside parts of the zucchinis. I have two here. I'm going to eat one tonight and then meal prep the other. I just have some Hunt's traditional pasta sauce that I'm adding. Okay, and this is the cheese that I'm going to use. I think I'm going to put down um, provolone first and then sprinkle it with some Italian cheese and then the Parmesan cheese. Lots of cheese, lots of meat, lots of sauce, lots of yummy zucchini. I, um, I did rub the zucchini down with some extra virgin olive oil. I rubbed that down and then I'm baking it for 10 minutes. I'll cut side down and then I will take it out and add my meat mixture, pile my cheeses, and bake it for another five minutes. All right, so here they are, fresh out of the oven, and those are hot, obviously. Heather, oh my gosh. So we're just going to turn these over. Um, I cooked them on 375 and I just cranked it up to 400 so I'm gonna get to filling these and then we'll finish them off I'm actually kind of upset because I had filmed myself putting on the sliced cheese and prepping these up alright guys I am sure this is gonna taste absolutely amazing and I did end up doing the second bake for about eight minutes but Yes, yummy. All right, here's Ian's dinner. Um, leftover pasta bake from yesterday that Uncle Ethan made, and a few strawberries. This is actually quite a big portion, but I added some of the meat sauce from this to this to make it not as dry because um, it dried it out reheating it. But this is what Ian's gonna have. This is what I'm gonna have. Um, Do you love pasta? Mm -hmm. Is it good? I guess so. Tarek, you're gonna get your hair in it. Why? Cause your hair, you're shaking your hair loose. My hair loose? I mean, this is delicious. Okay guys, it is Tuesday and we are going to grill tonight. I say barbecue, we're going to grill. So right now we are actually proofing the rolls in the oven, like 170, doors open. Gonna get a rise on those babies because um, we didn't unwrap them to proof, but that's okay. Um, and I'm doing sheet pan veggies, so I'll show you uh, what I'm doing for the veggies. Yes, yeah, so I have Brussels sprouts right now with just salt and pepper and a little bit of canola oil because Seth's mom can't eat olive oil. Um, and then I'm going to put some of this Italian seasoning on there. We've got some potatoes and half of a large onion. And then obviously, like always, we used our beefy onion soup mix. And then Seth is behind me making honey butter. Right, honey? Here are the rolls. This is pretty much as proved as we're going to get them because we have to start dinner. <laughs> All right, here's the steaks and the brats. Oh, those look really good. Now you understand. This one's mine. Well, I was thinking I'll just cut you this half of this one, and I'll eat this one and that one, or this one and this half. And then I'll have this half and a brat, if you wish. What if I want the whole thing? No, yeah, you're right. I'll have this and then a brat. <laughs> you know me better than I know myself. Congratulations. Uh, 
out when the rolls are done? Probably. Yeah. Is this one mine? Yes. Mm, looks good. Yeah, that's just a little bit pink. You could always go put it back on. Well, no, that's what I'm, that's what I'm. Oh my! Oh, mine's perfect. Yeah, your, okay. yours is good. Mine is the right amount of pink for me. Sweet. It should be salty, actually. I'm excited. It shouldn't be sweet. It should it should be kind of salty and a little bit peppery. Okay, I'm excited. That's a big piece of fat. We should give that to Murphy. No, that's mine. <laughs> that's mine. I'm eating that. All right, here is everything all finished. We have the rolls and the meat and the two trays of roasted veggies. Everything looks so, so yummy. So this is Ian's plate. He has a bratwurst, uh, orange carrot sticks, cheese sticks, and one of the rolls. Here's Seth's plate. He has a ribeye and a half and a bunch of potatoes and two rolls with honey butter. And here is my plate. I have half of a ribeye, a bunch of the veggies, a roll, two tablespoons of my sugar-free barbecue sauce, and a bratwurst, and I'm gonna have some honey butter. Okay, so it is Thursday, and I'm going to grill some chicken breasts. So this is actually at work tonight, but I'm going to grill some up for today and tomorrow, just because I had them in the fridge. I need to grill them, so let's get to prepping. So here's the chicken. I just cut it up. I'm gonna salt, pepper, garlic it, and then it's gonna go on the grill. All right, so we got the grill preheated. I'm just gonna go ahead and put my chicken on. All right, I just wanna say, you guys, I never really used gas burners until I got with Seth. Um, my family, we just use charcoal, so I'm, I'm trying to get the hang of this grilling thing. All right, this is what my chicken looks like. And I'm probably gonna eat, let's see, I actually, this was two large chicken breasts. So I'm pretty sure it went something along. This was one and this was one. So I'm probably gonna eat this side tonight and save this side for tomorrow. <laughs> Here's Ian's supper, a bratwurst leftover from the other day, carrot sticks, an orange, a big orange actually, <laughs> some um, cheese blend and broccoli and cauliflower. He will not eat the carrots cooked. He will eat fresh carrots only. <laughs> okay, and here is mine. I've got the one chicken breast, two tablespoons of my favorite barbecue sauce, new, <laughs> new favorite barbecue sauce. And then two cups of the California um, vegetable medley. So this is it for the rest of the today. And I'm still literally working on my coffee that I've been sipping on for the last two hours. This is my snack. I think I'm done with that. Moving on to this and loads of water.